Ever since cannabis became legal in certain states, especially California and Washington. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Yes, today you guys get to eat cereal. Anyway, our toilet paper attachment fell off. Every time we get toilet paper out, it, fall it falls right off and it makes this loud noise. It, I don't understand. We might find a different one. Yeah, we might have to buy another one. Hey, did you wash your hands? You've been standing there for like five minutes. Let's go wake up at the Juliana. Yeah. Happy birthday. I mean, happy birthday. Good morning. Where's Rhino? It's not baby, it's birthday now. No, it's not. Do so I say happy The reason I'm here in California is because we're going to Anaheim tonight for the workshop for YouTube Secrets. Anything you want to say, Sean? For the vlog? I'm just excited. <laughs> I mean, going to meet a lot of local people here in mm -hmm, Anaheim, Southern mm -hmm. California area, creatives, artists, entrepreneurs. That's our people, man. And so we uh, can't wait to uh, meet everybody and it's going to be fun. We got two more tour stops left, Provo, Utah and Las Vegas. And we're going to try to add some more in the future. So let me know in the comments what cities you guys would love for us to stop by. Um, for anybody that wants to meet Sean and I. Today, I think I'm gonna try this new face mask from Origins. It has um, cannabis sativa. What? Isn't that crazy? Let me go get it. I love their face masks, especially their charcoal one. It's one of my all-time favorites. This one is relaxing and hydrating mask, which is good because some parts of my face have been pretty dry lately. It's been cold here in the Northwest. Ew! Why does it look like a caterpillar? It doesn't smell like cannabis. It smells like a mix of herbs and fruit. Apply to clean skin, relax for 10 minutes, and tissue off. Massage in excess. Okay, so it's not a wash off mask. I don't know if you could tell, but you probably could. Yesterday's vlog was pre-recorded. In fact, it was pre-recorded, I think like almost two months ago, and it just took a little longer for them to um, approve the video. So that explains why Juliana's hair was long, our living room still had the spring decor, and Benji is in town. He's still away for his book tour. In fact, actually, I think he's um, at Vid Summit. Ever since cannabis became legal in certain states, especially California and Washington, I've noticed that a lot of brands are starting to look at it as like a, a marketing opportunity because there's another makeup brand. I'm pretty sure it's Milk. They made the very first cannabis oil mascara. It didn't work that well for me, like when I tried it, but I mean, cannabis sells, or like the excitement and it's something new. Anyways, this feels good. I kind of look like the Grinch. After this, I'm gonna wipe off and hit the gym. All right, guys, see you in a bit. About to do our podcast right now. coffee today the Pete's dark roast coffee I had this the first time I went to San Francisco and I remember it being delicious oh it's so good it doesn't even need any creamer or sugar I don't think we have Pete's cafes around here or if we do they're few and far because there's a Starbucks in every single corner
Oh wow, wow. How funny, it kind of looks like a face. It's kind of creepy. In addition to the workshop that we were here for, I'm also speaking here at Bid Summit. Got the whole team here. Also, we're gonna be playing in Dan Semmer later. Going to YouTube headquarters, so exciting week. You're only as good as your last at bat. I only just sit up here and talk about our truth. There's no slum on my mind. And we're gonna do a leftover casserole. The other day I made some garlic creamy chicken with some spinach and potatoes. The girls didn't really love it. We had it with rice, but this time I'm gonna make a casserole and add some pasta to it, and hopefully they'll like it then. I'm just gonna throw in random things. That's kind of the point of casserole, right? Hopefully it's good. So anyway, I'll just heat it up for 20 minutes in the oven when it's time for dinner. Your book changed our lives, me and Sean. One of the things I respect the most about you, you said, put your head down, be in the trenches, put on the blinders, right? So it was six years before I even thought about writing this, four years to perfect it. And you are in the book, 100 plus interviews is in the book. So it's not just our stories, you know, sure. my wife and I. So I just want to get, well, I know that I'll give it to Caleb, by the way. I don't know if you know, we grew up in the same town, right? Did you know each his, other? his mentor is Sean Cannell. So I, I just wanted to... Yeah, let's get a shot. Dude, everything you've done for our community, for me and my wife and my family is, is literally priceless. And I listen to the audio, um, the, the podcast more than ever because it's like I want your voice in my head because even though, you know, we have different yep. lives, you just drive me to be greater and better. And I just want to say, I, I appreciate it, bro. It makes me so happy, man. Hey, You're such you. a good dude. I can't yeah. wait to do it. Oh, what is this? Mommy, it's a holo. I'm in the holo. The girls said I have glitter in my eyes. Okay, look at it. No. Do you want um, white There? Oh, look at it. No. over your eyes. Put it close. Oh, okay. Uh, do I have glitter? Because look it. Mm. Ow! Okay, okay, I believe you. I'm trying one of the new PR products that I got. I think it's like too glittery. You're supposed to really pack on the product, but I don't want to look like a disco ball. It's really meant for going out, I believe, not in every day. Maybe it's just not for mommy. Ow! <laughs> Netflix saves the day. It's actually quite delicious. Mommy! What did mm. you do yesterday, Mommy? Mmm. You cooked that food for us? I did cook food for Mommy, you. I think that was nice. Mommy, what did you make today? It's when I was at school. It was cleanup time. I was playing with the drawing thing, but I'm helping. My other friends clean up their choo tree. I go clean your team for you. Oh, no, my package. My PR package. Yeah, that was nice. I, um, put away Mia gum cheap. Um, um, shell away because we were using it. Oh, that's very kind of you. Yeah. That was delicious. I ate two bowls. For dessert, I'm having the chocolate covered frozen bananas. I'm at having this a at Costco. Kiwi popsicle. Actually, that's a green juice popsicle. Green juice, but why do you say kiwi on the front? Well, maybe there's some kiwi in it, but there's also some vegetables in there. That mm -hmm. makes it very nutritious. I think our tomatoes are done, though. Goodbye, squirrel. Don't come back because you will, you eat all of our tomatoes, so don't come back. <laughs> okay, so this is a humidifier we've been using for the twins. Whoops, what'd I do? Oh, it's just the top there. 
it's really meant for bedtime so it doesn't use up the water as fast so i don't have to refill the water every night putting in the little vix thingy majigger i love the smell of vix the kids really like it and i feel like it really does help them go to sleep when they're not feeling too well and juliana has the twins old humidifier because she doesn't like the lights i swear those humidifiers are a big help even when they're sick they don't wake up in the middle of the night good night girlies i love you i'm gonna try to finish editing the vlog tonight and possibly watch a movie i haven't checked any new movies on netflix or amazon in a while so there should be some good ones calling it a night and i'll see you tomorrow night night